What's up, everybody? James Duggan here with Destin Legary. Hey. And we are checking out some of the crazy high-end weaponry uh, as well as gear in the division. That's right. We have uh, These are the best of the best that you can get right now. And this military MK46 that we're going to start with is ridiculous. Why don't you explain why? First of all, look at the DPS, 31,000. That blows my mind. Uh, but secondly, let's take a look at the talents. And these talents, of course, require a certain uh, commitment to firearm stamina and electronics. And the first one is restored. Killing a target with this weapon removes all negative status effects, which is great for PvP, you know, if you get hit with a grenade uh, and you kill your opponent, you'll be able to sprint away because your status effect will be gone. But the second one is totally mind-blowing. This, this is the one that's really crazy. Especially when you take into consideration Tactical Link, which is the tech uh, signature skill. It increases your damage by 100% and your crit chance by 30%, and this talent increases that duration by 18.5% every single time you get a kill. And let's not forget about the talent Deadly. Critical hit damage is increased by 26%, so you start stacking all these things together, and you can see why this is a monster. Basically, you pop Tactical Link, you start getting kills with this, and then your Tactical Link potentially could go on forever if you're able to kill people. Really faster. interesting. You actually purchased this with Phoenix credits. You can get some through the Uplay account, and I think you must get the rest through the dark, just Dark Zone stuff. And look at the DZ rank you have to be. 50. So that's obviously the max DZ rank for now. Yeah. Uh, level 30, and the gun is actually a level 31. Yes, item level 31. One better than the best level right. you can Before we game. go on to the Spec Ops pack, let's just show people where we are right now, actually. Good point. We are at the very north end of DZ06, and this is the safe house which uh, has this Dark Zone special vendor, um, and she just has some of the, the best gear. Well, I was surprised with the lack of diversity in weapons, but she mm -hmm. does sell all of these blueprints. She sells a ton of high-end blueprints. Mm -hmm. But let's talk about the Spec Ops backpack, which she also sells. This has a talent which adds 13% of your firearms and stamina to your skill power. I don't know about you, Destin, but I have been stacking um, firearms and stamina because they show immediate effects of damage and health. Uh, not so much electronics, but this well, kind been, of remedies that situation. I've been, if you use a lot of skills, electronics is great because it affects your skill power. You do more damage if you use the grenades, et cetera, et cetera. So, right. so that one's really good. I've been not focusing on health, more firearms and electronics myself. Just trying to keep it mostly balanced. Right. You know, and it's, it's not necessarily just for one archetype. Like, healers are going to benefit from this as well as people who are in tech and trying to do damage because mm -hmm. it's going to increase things like your turret damage uh, as well as your sticky grenade. But this, in case you are stacking firearms and stamina, gives you a little bit of skill power to boot, so that's really cool. And then we have this Operator Holster, which has the talent Steadfast. Uh, health regeneration kicks in twice as fast while in cover. That's really good. I mean, it's already pretty quick, so the fact that it speeds it up is great. It is indeed. Uh, and that is it for the high-end weaponry, but let's, let's take let's a look, look at, at one. Sure, superior, let's look at one superior. Um, this thing is no slouch. Yeah. The DPS is low, but that's because the damage is insane, mm -hmm. and the rate of fire is low, obviously, because it's a sniper rifle, though it, it looks like it's semi-automatic. Yeah, low, only 22,790 <laughs> DPS. It's all relative, Destin. Mm -hmm. uh, so we have two talents here because it is superior and not high-end. Um, one is... The last bullet of the magazine deals 50% more damage. I love that. Mm -hmm. That's a really good incentive not to reload every single time you shoot two bullets. Mm -hmm. And then uh, trained critical hits increase signature skill resources by 3.5%. What so about one of the armors, actually? I'm sure. Curious. Let's take a look. Uh, Let's at least look at each of them so assault people mask. can decide if they would like any of these. This one, so yeah, these don't even have great. talents because they're superior yeah. uh, armor. And I believe only the high-end armor... But you know what? You brought up a really good point a while ago where you were talking about Destiny and exotics and how you could only have one. Yeah, so can I only have one nope. high-end? You can have as many as you want, uh, or at least I had two in the open beta. I had a shotgun as well as Caduceus, the assault rifle. So when you start to take these uh, into consideration with the talents, the perks, and the uh, mods you can put on your abilities, like the customization starts to cut pretty deep. You start, you start getting an idea of just how crazy this is going to be at sure. the end game. Uh, so I'm only level 8, and I had to sneak here, and I'm actually just going to show people what that entailed really quick before we wrap this video up. Destin, why don't you plug the Division HQ? Division HQ is a new show on IGN starring myself, James Duggan, and Brandon Tyrell. We talk all about the Division. Next week, we're going to be talking about the review in progress with Vince Ingenito, our first guest. Uh, we're Ooh, that's really, exciting. really, really excited to uh, continue playing. Hit level 11 last night. I stayed up till 5.30 in the morning playing this I game. only stayed up till 3, and you made it into the office before I did, so Yeah, that's we're impressive. both crazy people. Anyway, this is why... You 
Yeah, there you go. Like he nicked you. I didn't. I didn't think I could bend that way, but apparently I can. <laughs> uh, for all things the division, keep it right here on IGN. <laughs>